Hello everyone and welcome back to another Draft to Glory Team USA edition. If you guys enjoy this episode, be sure to the like button. The Vancouver Canucks. Let's go check them out here. See how we stack up. JT Miller. Patterson and Besser versus Furland. Horvat, Bailey. I follow Korea for Tannen. Lind Carter VC. Hughes Manson U Levy Myers. Yeah. Dem Markstrom and D Pietro. We just don't stack up to these guys. There's not much we can do about it. But EA Logic will probably smoke them. I wouldn't be surprised. AHL made the playoffs too. It's pretty good. Yeah, see? 3 nothing lead after one. Crater, Jones, and Sanford. Nothing in the second. Yeah, the worst team seems to always win the series. I don't get it. 4 nothing. Milano puts a goal in. Crazy start to game one. Was Markstrom in net for period one? He was. So he probably got pulled after that one. Doesn't matter though. 4 nothing win for us in game one. Is our coach defensive? I'm actually curious here. Uh, no, he's a generalist. You'd think with how defensive this team is, he'd be defensive. Huh. That's all right. Game two in Vancouver. Two nothing lead in the first period. Nickerson gets his first playoff goal. Crider gets one again. After the second, nothing again. Vancouver gets a power play in the third, and Milano scores right after and make it three nothing. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. Two minutes left, one, and we win game two, three nothing. Two shutouts for DeSmith. Milano has four points. He's a second liner though this year. He's gotta be, right? Yeah, he's second left side. No, he's third. What the heck? Getzloff's got an assist. Nickerson has got a goal and assist. HL, how are these guys developing? McCormick has not moved. Garrison has moved up one. Adams has moved up two. At center. Oh, he's right wing, you know. I mean, I was like, what? Where is he? <laughs> he's on the right side. Up to a 70. Still hasn't moved from that 70, which is okay. All right. Game three. One nothing lead to Kaiser getting a goal. Two nothing lead after two. Sanford puts one home. Oh, they finally score. U Levy gets the first goal for the Canucks in this series. Game three, and they finally put one in. And I follow ties it up. Wow, they actually have some fighting them. Out there, just gonna give us the queen. Clean 404 shutouts. Three minutes left. Can we get the game winner? And we're going to overtime. All right, come on, guys. Knock this series into a three nothing lead. Thirteen minutes left in the first overtime. Oh, we gotta kill this power play, and we do big kill, and we get on the power play. Oh, they get on the power play. Oh, big kills all around. And this first overtime is going to go to waste. Second overtime. <sighs> Vancouver finally gets their first win. Manson scores to give them the game winner. 
All right. Neither team has won on home ice yet. All right. After the first, Stefan and Sanford twice. Bailey gets one back. 3-1 lead for us. Okay, we fall apart in the second. Carter, VC, and Horvat get three get three goals for the Canucks. Miller gets another, and we are down 5-3 in the third. Okay, we waste a power play. If we're going to win this game, we need to score now. Vertan and that one's just over. 7-3 loss for us. Unfortunate. Neither team can win on home ice. Good thing we're going back on the road. All right, one nothing lead after the first, three nothing lead after the second. <laughs> no team can win at home. Van Riemsdyk and who was it? De Kaiser there too. Yeah. All right, 15 minutes left in the third. How is this one going to shake out? Seven minutes left, and we got the solid lead. This one's over. Yeah, no goals in that. We get the three nothing win in this game. Three two lead in the series. Back to home, so we should lose. All right. Yeah, there it is. Miller scores in the first one. Nothing leave Vancouver. 2-1. Gets off. Gets his goal. Patterson scores. If we can score on this power play and tie it up. And Gelchanik scores right after. Patterson scores, though. 3-2 lead for Vancouver. 4-2 lead. Geo, Geo was on this team. Cryer gets it back within one. Don't remember seeing Geo Dano on this team. Oh, well. Seven minutes left for us to tie. Are we going to do it? The answer is no. Game seven, we're not going to change a thing. We're in Vancouver. We've won every away game in this series. We're not touching the team. Nothing after the first. 3-1 lead for Vancouver after the second. Bailey, I follow Miller. Shattenkirk gets one back. Wow. Okay, maybe I should have changed the team. Another power play gone to waste. We don't score in the power play. Need this kill, and then we need a goal. Need to kill this and get a goal. Ah, the game's just over. All right, we went out with a whimper in the first round. That's okay. Wasn't expecting too much. This is what I wanted to see. Go to view draft class. Uh, we made the playoffs. So that guy's off the table. Maybe Tambilla. Tambellini, two years out, okay, medium top four, wouldn't be horrible, that's pretty much our only first round option because we don't have the other two uncovered, what kind of medium six, medium nine there, going deep, more medium six is more than nine, here's a low top six late in the second, Another low top six. Okay, medium elite. Two bars, three years out. Let's see if we can get that guy scouted. For that guy's a medium four. Um, we need to do this easier way. West. Okay, maybe this is our goalie. Low elite defense and right there. That guy's a guaranteed pick. McKenzie for the future. Other than that, nobody great. In the central, we are looking at... 
Need him elites, two bars. Could be a pick. Another two bar goalie goalie. Thompson is one bar. Let's see what he is. Low four. No thank you. Um I went in the east. East is not looking well at all. Yeah, nobody's getting taken out of the east. Okay, that's fine. Um, stop simulation. I want to see, did they win? Okay, Collar Cup playoffs for our Burnaby Aces. Robinson with 12 points. Advanced day. Game one. They win. Game two. They win. Game three. They win. One more. Game four. Burnaby Aces take the Calder Cup. Let's go. Simming up to the draft here. Uh, we got about half an hour, so we can do this draft. Where are we going to land? It won't tell us. Yeah. Let's see retired. I could see um, Akpozo retiring on us. Yeah, there he goes. It's our first ever retirement. He didn't want to make 750k. That's okay. Parisi's gone. Back is Parisi. Yeah, yeah. Back is Sajak, Opozo, Sebra, Gagne, Dubinsky. Some big names. Soderberg, Miller, Schneider, and Hutton are your three goalies that actually matter. Anyone else from our team? Answer is no. I want to offer trades so I can write down the numbers. Let's go draft picks. God, we're so late. 21st, 53rd, 85th, the 117th, the 149th, the 181st, and the 213th. If we go, look at this draft class here. And we go to the west. Tambellini's off the board for us. Okay, Gibson at 157 is a guaranteed medium elite. Uh, we do need a goalie for the future, so it's probably going to be Gibson picked up here. 193rd, low elite here in Jay McKenzie. Probably a good defenseman for our future to grab. Okay, that's pretty much it out of the west. I think we said no one out of the east, correct? Yeah, I don't know what we're going to do for that first round First round pick. 51st is the highest here, and here 34th, a medium 6. What's in the central here? 32nd, a medium 9. God. Looking down here, um, I don't know what to do here. Um, Coop, 148th. No, we could look to take Coop or Whitfield. Cooper Whitfield. Well. We're getting our medium league goal out of the draft. We gotta optimize picks here. So we're probably gonna take Coop. Eighty fifth, fifty third, and twenty first. So Probably be for the 83rd, 85th. It's probably going to end up having to be Thornton. 
or Delmas if he's there. And if we want to look at taking Prince, who could be a steal, we could look at taking him with the 51st or 53rd. And then grab one of these low top sixes, maybe. Two years out. No weaknesses on that guy, though. 80 overall sniper. Kennis was 81. Is that American gone? Rankin. Fell to third. Let's see what he is. 79, yeah. 79 center. That would have been great. God. Alright. 21st. Options include Center Polisek. Know nothing about. Oda, a center we know nothing about. Nystrom. Three years out, top nine. Not gonna happen. Fairchild. Three years out, medium top six. Not gonna happen. Liston. Don't know anything about. Angelitis. Don't know anything about. Fowler. Walton here. It's B's and C's. No weaknesses. Three years out. Or Muzzin. Two years out with an E in skating. But B's and A's. I think we're going to take Muzzin and hope no one else is like a steal. 65 overall. Fairchild was the American. I don't think you can check actually. Over to top nine. Top six, sixty-five. Polsek was an option, I think. Send to fifty-third here. Um. I think with the knowledge we had, that's probably the best pick we could do. Dumont. We got to see if that was available to us. Let's go talk to Boston. Or go check out Boston quick. I think it's a forward, right? Please tell me he's not American. Please, 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 please. Uh, well, he didn't play in an American League here. Yeah, so we have no report on this player, so he, I don't think he's American. Like, if we go look at... Who do we take? Oh, God, I don't even remember. Smithson? No. Muzzin. I can't even see a report. Oh well, whatever. I think we did the best we could with that. I want to call a timeout here just so we have extra time. 53rd. Two medium top nines. First options. Three years out. Three years out. I don't want a medium top nine though. Walton is still available. Um, another medium top nine. We thought about reaching for Prince here. A's, B's, and C's three years out. Could be a medium nine just like all the other guys. Um, uh, 
I think we got to go for Prince here. We need to get a big pickup here. Medium nine. Yeah, jeez. Con, 63 overall, same thing. Uh, that wasn't even the guy, actually. Um, Zizika, 64. Not like he was anything better. 85th overall, here. Did that one guy just go... Was it Wallace? No, it was Delmers. I don't think he's taken. Yeah, he was. Delmars, Delmars, Delmars. Oh, right there. Medium nine. Yeah, lovely. So our option here is Thornton. And next we're looking at, like Coop for the next pick. Anything in there better? Answer is not that we have uncovered. So if we take, eh, he's the best player probably up here. He's probably a medium six though. We gotta risk it though. Hopefully he's a medium four and yeah, medium six. God, we can't get any good picks this draft. Medium elite, Kuba leak. Hope he wasn't one of our guys. Kubalika goalie there. Oh, he was a defense in 50 overall though. Whatever. Um, we just don't have enough fun cover on these people here. We're gonna take Coop. The 117th. Medium nine. God, we can't get anything good. I want to see what that like Nesbit guy is and the other guys that were completely uncovered. Hainsey, low top nine. Nesbit bottom six. Okay. Okay. Coop's still not medium nine. Not horrible. 149th. We can look at Thompson. Oh, this is where we're taking the goalie here. We need this goalie for our future. So there's Gibson, 47 overall, medium elite. He's going to take his sweet time getting to us, but make this draft somewhat useful. With the next pick, we were looking at like McKenzie. Yeah. I think he's our best option. Oh yeah, by far. Mackenzie it is. 53 overall, low elite defenseman. Got a little bit better as the draft went on. With the last pick, what are we going to take here? We got a medium 6. He's like 2 years out. 5. A starter. I think we're set on goalies. I mean, we have a high starter, a medium starter, 2 fringes. And now a medium elite. Do we want out, outlaw low nine? Five years out. Uh, medium six would probably be better in Zeeler. No, he has worse grades. Yeah, let's just pick up Zealer here. We'll sim a bit and see what I lost. 50 overall. That guy's never making it. Uh, hopefully I lost not too far. I don't want to sim this whole thing. Low Elite and Hewitt. You draft glass here. Lamb Outlaw is coming up. Oh. 
I lost I'm gonna get drafted. Okay. Well, Mackenzie and Gibson are basically the only picks out of the draft that will probably matter. Maybe we can get Muzzin up there. Another disappointing draft. Alright, everyone. That's going to do it for today's episode. Be sure to like and subscribe on YouTube and follow on Twitch to watch me play live.